this is a, a little tutorial to show you how you can have um, reference photos in Curvy. Um, first thing I'm going to do is split my view into two. So I'm going to hold down on the little square in the top left and that gives me options for different view layouts. I'm going to choose two and then I can pick which view I have in a pane from this 3D view again by holding down the mouse. So I'm going to pick perspective on the left and backdrop on the right. Um, at the moment I don't have a backdrop loaded so I'm going to go down to the backdrops panel. Uh, you might have to show it using view panels smart backdrops. And then I'm going to load an image. Now at the moment <coughs> the image is shown behind my model which isn't great. Uh, we can switch that to like a, a tracing mode um, by holding down on the name of the view and choosing overlay background. And this is great for maybe drawing in a lathe um, and editing an individual object. As you see the, the lathe lines appear quite bright. Uh, so it's, it's, it's easy enough to make outlines and shapes. But say you want to copy some details in the sculpting, then you want the picture to be fully opaque. So again I'm going up to the top left where it says backdrop, the name of the view, and I'm choosing opaque background. That means that the image I've loaded completely obscures my model and then I can copy the details in my other view, in my perspective view, um, using the my reference image to help me edit. And that's how to show a quick reference image in Kirby.